Many times the flashing at the base of the wall gets installed pretty well everywhere except on an outside or inside corner. What you're noticing is an example of a poured wall foundation with some framing above and a recessed brick ledge. Notice how the flashing goes on. Starting from the left hand side, uh, all you have to do is make one small cut along the top of the brick ledge there at the corner and fold around. Same thing back from the other side after some mastic is applied. Those two would stick together well at the corner. Having the paper now on, you can see that that corner cannot leak. But this is what I normally see. The flashing comes from both ways, terminates at the corner, and there's no overlapping or sealing done there. Many times with block, you'll see specified or a contractor buy a preformed boot, it's called sometimes, to place on a corner so that the flashing can be adhered to it. That's a bit expensive, so notice it could be done the same way as with wood frame or steel studs. Just use a piece of flashing, cut it back at the brick ledge, put some mastic there, let it come back from the other direction. Then once you set the next block in place, you could see that you could continue on up to the top of the building and then just damp proof, spray on damp proofing above that area. An inside corner can be a problem as well. Many times we see those leak. So it's just a matter of forming a very simple pan and letting them come together in an inside corner, both from the right and left, as you're seeing displayed behind me. If you'd like to know how that pan folds, it's a very simple process. You just take a flat piece of flashing, cut it four or five feet long so it's easy to work with, and then notice how this folds, the leading edge at the base as well as the back folds up, creating a pan, and it's just a matter of making two and sliding them into an inside corner, placing a little mastic between the two. So uh, I guess if I had to say which leaks the most or what flashing fails the most, what installation, I'd say either at the window head or at the base of the wall. So it's important to get those inside and outside corners flashed properly.